Our society depends on law enforcement officers who put themselves in harm's way daily to keep communities safe. These uniformed heroes deal with the worst of humanity so that the rest of us can sleep soundly. To do their difficult job, officers need peak physical fitness. While most bulk up enough to serve, some stand out for their sheer size and strength, looking like one-person anti-crime units. Join us as we show you the world's biggest and strongest police officers. Thomas Davis A correctional officer by day but champion powerlifter by night, Thomas Davis has made his mark in the strength sports world under his fitting nickname, TD Smash. Weighing over 400 pounds and standing well over 6 feet tall, his massive frame was built perfectly for displaying extreme feats of power. Davis serves dutifully at the Elkhart County Jail in Indiana, while also competing when he can take time away from his law enforcement duties. Only a few years ago in 2018, Davis won a world title at the IPF Raw Powerlifting World Championships. Despite having relatively little experience compared to most on the international platform, he immediately smashed competition records en route to taking first place overall. In the process, he bench-pressed an astonishing 718 pounds raw without a bench shirt. This remains one of the biggest raw bench presses ever performed in powerlifting history. Davis also has other competition bests, including a 1,025-pound raw squat and 860-pound raw deadlifts. He is capable of manhandling weight that would cripple even the strongest powerlifters. Outside prison duties, Davis can be seen on social media training with intensity to improve his already incredible strength. With such mammoth power and physicality, it's clear no inmate would dare get out of line under his watch. The aptly nicknamed TD Smash has more than enough force and authority to maintain order and security among the boldest convicts. Dalip Singh Imagine getting arrested by the WWE World Heavyweight Champion. For many lawbreakers in India during the 1990s, this scenario was a real possibility thanks to one incredibly imposing police officer named Dalip Singh. Of course, he had not yet achieved wrestling stardom at that time, but was still an intimidating presence. Before gaining worldwide fame as the great Kali in professional wrestling, Dalip served dutifully for three years as an assistant sub-inspector with the Punjab police force. Even back then, his enormous size and strength were obvious. Born in 1972, Dalip stood an unbelievable seven feet, one inch tall, and weighed well over 350 pounds with very little fat. He was perhaps the largest man in all of India, in 1993, he decided to put his naturally mammoth frame to use by joining the Punjab police. Criminals took one look at Officer Singh and immediately knew not to cause trouble. Only a few years into his law enforcement career, Dalip became enthralled by competitive bodybuilding. He entered regional shows and used his genetics and police training to quickly develop an intimidating physique. Dalip won prestigious titles like Mr. India in 1995 and 1996. At his peak conditioning on stage, he weighed nearly 400 pounds, completely dwarfing all previous Indian bodybuilding champions. Many experts consider Dalip the largest competitive bodybuilder in history. His chest and shoulder width were unrivaled. According to urban legends circulated around Punjab gyms, Dalip could bench press 600 pounds and barbell curl over 200 pounds for repetitions when training. Of course, a man standing seven feet tall would need incredible strength just to move around effectively day to day. After dominating the national bodybuilding circuit, Dalip transitioned to professional wrestling in 2000 and adopted his signature Great Kali persona. But even devoted WWE fans were familiar with his origins as a Punjab policeman and bodybuilder. During his wrestling career, Dalip's unmatched size and strength allowed him to easily overpower opponents. He utilized his signature brain chop to humble even the most brazen foes. At his peak, there was no man in the WWE roster who could match power with this Punjabi police legend turned wrestling icon. Ronnie Coleman Mention the name Ronnie Coleman to any serious fan of bodybuilding and you're sure to elicit reactions of awe and respect. With eight consecutive Mr. Olympia titles stretching from 1998 through 2005, Coleman dominated his competition, unlike any other champion before or after. 
During the apex of his record-breaking career, he also worked as a police officer in Arlington, Texas. Standing 5 feet 11 inches tall and weighing up to 330 pounds in the off-season, Coleman was famous for showcasing an otherworldly level of muscular size and density. When he stepped on stage, his physique resembled a real-life superhero plucked straight from the pages of a comic book. Coleman began his journey as a police officer in 1989, after earning his degree in accounting. Eleven proud years serving in law enforcement culminated with Coleman capturing his first Mr. Olympia crown in 1998. For the next eight straight years, no one could touch his mind-blowing displays of shredded mass and strength. Even a young challenger named Jay Cutler was humbled repeatedly by Coleman from 2001 through 2003. Out of the gym and police uniform, Coleman transformed into a hulking leviathan capable of squatting 800 pounds and deadlifting the same. His indomitable work ethic coupled with elite genetics allowed him to sculpt what many lifters consider the perfect bodybuilding physique. Criminals surely thought twice before attempting unlawful activities with the possibility of confronting Coleman on patrol. Johnny Green Johnny Green is a police officer in Dallas, Texas, who possesses an incredibly impressive physique and jaw-dropping strength. Born in 1980, Green began bulking up his frame at a young age when he joined the United States Marine Corps prior to turning 20 years old. It was the demanding training required by the Marines that allowed Green to pack on muscle and hone his athletic talents. After completing his service, Green stood 6 feet 4 inches tall and weighed approximately 350 pounds of pure muscle. His massive size is perfectly proportional and he cuts an extremely intimidating figure. Throughout his weightlifting career, Green has focused on core strength movements like bench pressing, overhead pressing, and squatting. He is capable of strength feats that seem almost superhuman. Perhaps his most impressive lift is the bench press. Green can cleanly press 600 pounds, the weight of a full-grown male grizzly bear, for a single repetition. The amount of power needed to push that much weight straight up into the air from a lying position is mind-boggling. Very, very few individuals can claim membership in the ultra-exclusive 600-pound bench press club. In addition to his freakish bench pressing capability, Green can also overhead press an enormous 405 pounds in the seated position. This requires the shoulders and arms to press the weight directly overhead without the advantage of leg drive. For most experienced weightlifters, a 200-pound seated overhead press would be considered extremely respectable. The fact that Green can literally double that weight highlights his incredible power and strength. When Green takes to social media to showcase his fitness, strength, and physique, his hulking build and hardcore no-nonsense attitude paint him as the epitome of a tough, intimidating law enforcement officer. He has garnered a considerable following online by displaying his training videos and offering fitness advice. Seeing a police officer as massively built and powerful as Green would surely make even the most brazen criminal think twice before attempting to resist arrest or get into an altercation. His sheer size and strength commands respect. With such capabilities, Green has all the necessary physical tools to effectively carry out his duties and maintain law and order. Hugo Girard Hailing from Canada, Hugo Girard is a veritable legend in the world of professional strongman competitions who also served dutifully as a police officer for over a decade. During his athletic career competing atop the upper echelon of strength athletics, Gerard managed to capture an awe-inspiring six consecutive Canada's Strongest Man titles. In addition, he was crowned the World Muscle Power Champion on four separate occasions and won the prestigious Strongman Super Series in 2002. Standing six feet, one inch tall and weighing around 330 pounds of pure muscle, Gerard intimidated his competition with his Herculean physique and dauntless strength. Although he never managed to claim first place at the World's Strongest Man contest, Gerard was a perennial threat to take home the championship. He reached the final stage of the competition each year from 1998 through 2004, an incredible six straight appearances against the very best strongmen on earth. At the 2001 World's Strongest Man event, Gerard hoisted an enormous 765-pound deadlift to demonstrate his otherworldly power 
before retiring from competition several years later. Even well into his 50s, the Canadian legend has maintained much of his godlike strength. In 2003, at the very pinnacle of his abilities, Gerard set a new world record in the log lift by pressing an axle with 410 pounds overhead. As if these strength credentials weren't enough, he also served as a loyal police officer in Canada for 12 proud years. Criminals surely thought twice before attempting to break the law with this living strongman legend patrolling the streets. Sergio Oliva Few names in the history of professional bodybuilding conjure up images of otherworldly muscle and power quite like that of Sergio Oliva. Nicknamed The Myth, during his explosive rise to fame in the 1960s, Oliva possessed what many consider the perfect physique, along with superhuman strength. Even more impressive, he maintained his sculpted and massive frame while actively serving as a policeman for the city of Chicago. Oliva, originally from Cuba, grew up lifting weights from a very young age. He took an immediate liking to strength training and by the time he was a teenager could already clean and jerk over 300 pounds. After defecting from Cuba as a young adult, Oliva continued bodybuilding and developing his mythic proportions. At just 5 feet, 10 inches tall but carrying nearly 230 pounds of shredded muscle, he won his first Mr. Universe competition in 1963. This marked the genesis of his lengthy reign over the bodybuilding world. For the next several years leading into the late 1960s, Oliva was utterly unbeatable on the competition stage. He won the prestigious title three straight times from 1967 through 1969. During this dominant run, he handed Arnold Schwarzenegger his very first major loss, famously defeating the future seven-time Mr. Olympia in a battle of pure muscle and sinew. Even today, many experts and fans feel that Oliva exhibited the ideal balance of mass, proportion, cuts, and definition. Though he possessed one of the most impressive physiques ever seen, Oliva remained humble and dedicated himself to public service as a police officer patrolling the streets of Chicago. Any criminal who dared test his authority was in for a rude awakening once confronted by the legendary strength and power of this iconic bodybuilder. Eighth place in both editions. He passed away on November 12, 2012, at the age of 71. He died due to kidney failure. Andrus Muromets Andrus Muromets is an Estonian strongman competitor turned police officer who has participated in various international strength athletics tournaments. Born in 1970 80, Muromets began training as a strongman in his early 20s. From 2003 through 2009, he was a regular fixture at major strongman competitions. His highest ranking was achieving fifth place overall at the world's strongest man contest. Although he never claimed first place at the most prestigious events, Muromets established himself as one of the strongest men on the planet. At his physical peak, he stood approximately six feet, two inches tall, and weighed around 315 pounds. Much of his training focused on three signature strongman events, the log press, farmer's walk, and axle clean and press. In the log press, competitors must lift a heavy wooden log up to their chest before hoisting it overhead. Murumets set a world record in the log press by lifting an enormous 408 pounds overhead. For the farmer's walk, he would carry two 160-pound weights in each hand down a 50-meter course faster than anyone else. His axle clean and press personal record was 419 pounds. The axle utilizes a thick, unbending bar which is more challenging for the hands and wrist joints than a typical Olympic barbell. Murumets had extremely powerful grip strength, as evidenced by his performance in these events. In addition to competing, he also earned world records in the Rolling Thunder Grip Challenge and a Timber Carry Medley. After retiring from international strongman contests, Murumets became a police officer in his native Estonia in 2011. He has served as an upstanding member of the law enforcement community for over a decade now. Without a doubt, his elite strength gives him a major advantage when engaged in physical confrontations or when restraining unruly suspects. Very few criminals would dare test their luck against this Estonian strongman turned cop. Derek Poundstone As a professional strongman and police sergeant, Derek Poundstone has the best of both worlds. 
he is extremely physically powerful, yet devoted to protecting the public. Born in 1981, Poundstone grew up in Connecticut and showed athletic promise from a very early age. He won the state powerlifting championship in high school before taking a brief break from competitive strength sports. From 2000 to 2003, Poundstone focused his efforts on public service by attending the police academy and becoming an officer. Once his law enforcement training was complete, he jumped back into competing and began dominating strongman contests across the country. Standing six feet, one inch tall, and weighing around 340 pounds, Poundstone was one of the largest competitors on the scene, giving him substantial leverage for lifting events. He placed high in the 2006 America's Strongest Man contest before reaching the peak of his career from 2008 onward. In 2008, he achieved a career-best second-place finish at the prestigious World's Strongest Man Tournament. Some of his most awe-inspiring strength feats include deadlifting an enormous 914 pounds and log pressing 350 pounds overhead. Poundstone won the Arnold Strongman Classic on two occasions, once in 2009 and again in 2011. In addition, he was crowned America's Strongest Man three consecutive times from 2009 to 2011, defeating the rest of the nation's elite strongmen. Despite his packed competition and training schedule, Poundstone continues to excel as a police sergeant. He takes pride in bringing strength, power, and authority to his law enforcement role. Very few people dare act unlawfully in Poundstone's jurisdiction, knowing that this professional strongman could easily apprehend them single-handedly. Jeff Capes Hailing from Britain, Jeff Capes cemented himself as one of the strongest and most successful track and field athletes of the 1960s and 70s. As if his esteemed sporting career wasn't enough, Capes also served dutifully as a police constable for over a decade, upholding justice around Cambridge during the 1970s after retiring from athletic competition. Standing a towering 6 feet, 5 inches, and weighing approximately 375 pounds, Capes was a gentle giant outside the throwing circle, but transformed into a living legend once the competition began. He represented Britain proudly by earning gold medals at both the Commonwealth Games and European Championships. No shot putter in UK history has won more international medals than Capes. In 1983, he was deservedly voted the greatest British field athlete of all time by a panel of experts. Capes didn't limit himself solely to shot put either. He also competed extensively in strongman contests, winning Europe's strongest man three times and Britain's strongest man on two occasions. At the peak of his power, Capes could squat over 800 pounds and bench press nearly 700 pounds. He had the capability to tear a phone book in half with his bare hands or bend a solid steel bar more than one inch thick simply by gripping it. After retiring from athletic endeavors, Capes answered the call of public service by patrolling the streets as a police officer. Marku Swannenvirta Hailing from Finland, Marku Swannenvirta made his mark as both a professional strongman and a dutiful police officer. He was instrumental in founding Finland's Strongest Man competition in 1987 and subsequently managed to capture the title himself a few years later. Standing six feet tall and weighing around 280 pounds of dense muscle, Swannenvirta cut an imposing figure. In 1991, he reached the pinnacle of his career by qualifying for the final stage of the prestigious World's Strongest Man contest. Although he didn't win the overall championship, finishing seventh was still an incredible achievement against the best strongmen on earth. This remains the highest finish ever for a competitor from Finland. Some of Swannenvirta's most impressive strength feats include a 705-pound raw squat, 464-pound raw bench press, and 705 pounds raw deadlift. He had world-class strength across the board, particularly in the squat and deadlift, which require tremendous technique and power. Outside of lifting weights, Swannenvirta also had remarkable athleticism and endurance. Throughout the grueling World's Strongest Man shows, he consistently placed near the top in demanding events like the Atlas Stones, where competitors must lift and carry five massive concrete balls across a short course. His combination of brute force and conditioning gave him an edge. After retiring from professional strongman contests, 
Suonenvirta dedicated his life to public service by working as a police officer in Finland. Criminals surely thought twice before attempting to resist arrest or fight this former world's strongest man finalist. His legacy continues to inspire strongmen and powerlifters from Finland. Now it's time for today's subscriber pick. Getting pulled over is never a welcome experience. But can you imagine seeing this mountain of an officer in your rearview mirror? Stopping seems the only option, as he looks able to halt vehicles through brute strength alone. Though his background is unknown, the way he towers over those around him suggests he may well be the world's biggest and strongest police officer. Pursuing law enforcement while maintaining his strongman training seems a fitting path for such a giant. For criminals, watching this massive officer strolling toward them would surely be the stuff of nightmares. What do you think of this hulking guardian of the law? Share your thoughts in the comments. Martin Forsmark Martin Forsmark, a police officer from Sweden, managed to ascend to the top of the strongman mountain in his home country twice by capturing back-to-back -back Sweden's Strongest Man titles in 2018 and 2019. Standing 6 feet, 6 inches, and weighing around 360 pounds, his enormous stature gives him sizable advantages in events like the Atlas Stones, Truck Pull, and Log Lift. However, Forsmark has also conditioned his body to possess impressive athleticism by complementing his strength training with sports like ice hockey in his early years. Some of his best powerlifting numbers include a 915-pound deadlift and four 40-pound log presses, which require explosive hip drive and shoulder stability, respectively. Even more impressive, Forsmark has pulled that much weight in a conventional style with his feet under him, rather than the easier sumo stance. Very few men in the world can lift as much weight off the floor as this Swedish police officer. In addition to his strongman competition accomplishments, Forsmark has amassed a considerable following on social media where he displays his training techniques. Fans love watching him effortlessly lift weights in the gym that would cause most lifters to immediately crumble. Between his two Sweden's Strongest Man Championships, Forsmark proved he was more than just a one-hit wonder. His consistent podium finishes against Europe's elite ensure he will remain a threat for years to come. Forsmark is poised to continue bringing prestige and glory to Swedish strength sports. Park Seong-yong Park Seong-yong is a South Korean police officer and bodybuilder who has recently shot to viral internet fame thanks to his impressively muscular physique. With the social media explosion in popularity across Asia, Park has become the face of a new movement showing off the tough yet sculpted frames of police officers in Korea. Born in 1990, Park began lifting weights and training for bodybuilding competitions in his late teens. He instantly took to the sport and loved the challenge of molding his body into peak physical condition through hard work and dedication. His consistent training in the gym paid off by giving him a classically proportional aesthetic build accentuated by diamond-shaped calves, bulging biceps, and a rock-hard six-pack. Standing 5 feet, 8 inches tall, and weighing approximately 180 pounds on stage, Park cuts an intimidating profile despite not having the sheer mass of elite open division bodybuilders. When he competes, he regularly places very high in the ranks, earning IFBB pro status. Away from the competition stage, Park works as a respected police officer. Influenced by him, police departments around South Korea have begun holding their own bodybuilding competitions to showcase the most muscular members of the force. Everyone wants to be the next buff cop celebrity like Park. In addition to his bodybuilding and duties on the police force, Park is very family-oriented. He can often be seen happily posing and training with his wife and kids. For this bodybuilder-turned-viral policeman, maintaining his invading physique and inspiring others seem to be his passion. Kyle Curvey In his 20s, Kyle Curvey has already established himself as an absurdly strong correctional officer and champion powerlifter. Hailing from New Jersey, Curvey realized his natural strength and talents from a very young age. During high school, he excelled at football, wrestling, and lacrosse. It was clear he possessed the genetics to become a phenomenal athlete. After a stint in the National Guard, Curvey first ventured into competitive powerlifting in 2017. He immediately won his local competition, confirming that power athletics would be a great fit for him. The next year, 
He shocked the powerlifting world by capturing first place at the USA Powerlifting Bench Nationals meet. Despite having very little experience at the time, Curve pressed an incredible 557 pounds to set state and national records. Currently, Curve stands approximately 6 feet tall and weighs around 285 pounds. He is focused on building up his strength in the core compound lifts like the squat, bench press, and deadlift. At a recent powerlifting battle, he squatted 804 pounds, bench pressed 606 pounds, and deadlifted 804 pounds. Each of these are insanely impressive numbers, especially for someone so young. In addition to his duties as a corrections officer, Curve continues to train hard and compete when he can find the time. Now earning the nickname Tiger, it's clear he has the raw power, determination, and potential to become one of the greatest strength athletes in the world. He may just be getting started, but this prodigy is already dominating the competition against even the most seasoned lifters. Kirill Sarachev When it comes to displaying raw power and unbelievable strength, very few individuals throughout history can match the accomplishments of Kirill Sarachev. This Russian phenomenon has managed to capture numerous all-time world records across the core powerlifting exercises that measure pure brute force. Even more impressively, Sarachev achieved these record-shattering lifts while serving dutifully as a police officer in Moscow for several years. He stood at an imposing 6 feet, 6 inches tall, and weighed nearly 400 pounds, giving him an ideal strongman build. Powerlifting fans first took notice of Sarachev in late 2015, when he shocked the world by bench-pressing an extraordinary 738 pounds without the aid of a bench shirt. This demolished the previous all-time raw world record and immediately put Sarachev on the map. To this day, only a very select few human beings have ever lifted more weight off their chest than this Russian giant. The bench press tests sheer pushing power and pec strength. For many lifters, a three-pound bench is considered respectable. The fact that Sarachev could nearly triple that weight highlights his freakish abilities. In addition to his bench press prowess, Sarachev dominated in the squat and deadlift as well. He set a personal record in the squat by sinking 794 pounds low on his legs. A true testament to his massive quads and glute strength, Sarachev saved the best for last by locking out a mammoth 904 pounds in the deadlift, an unprecedented number. The deadlift ranks amongst the truest measures of real-world functional strength. Very few athletes of any kind could hope to pull half as much weight off the floor as this Russian police officer. At his peak abilities, Sarachev totaled a mind-blowing 2,460 pounds over the three powerlifting disciplines. No other human on record has lifted more weight in competition than him. Even years after retiring, his records mostly still stand tall, and his legend continues growing. Sarachev remains one of the strongest men to have ever walked the earth. Jari Sario For over 18 years, Jari Sario has served as a respected police officer in his native Finland. However, when off-duty and outside the uniform, he becomes a champion powerlifter with some of the best raw strength numbers in the country. Standing 5 feet, 10 inches tall, and weighing around 324 pounds, Sario possesses the ideal physique for moving serious weight. He has taken part in numerous local and European powerlifting competitions throughout his lengthy career. Some of his most impressive gym lifts include a 794-pound raw squat, 457 pounds raw bench press, and 805-pound raw deadlifts. Very few lifters, especially in his body weight class, can claim membership to the elite 800-plus pound deadlift club. Sario's excellent technique, brute power, and determination have served him well over nearly two decades of chasing strength gains. He has managed to largely avoid major injuries, which can prematurely end a powerlifter's career. Police departments require extraordinary physical fitness given the demands of the job. Sario's immense strength and experience as a powerlifter have certainly prepared him well for any physical confrontations he encounters on patrol. Any Finnish criminals who challenge this strongman cop quickly learn they made a grave mistake. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.